The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. This is seeingeagles.com. I'm the voice of the Eagles, Adam Cavalier, alongside Carson Newman, head men's basketball coach Chuck Benson. Chuck, finally time uh, to tip this thing off. How nice is it to actually get out on the floor uh, and have a chance to see your guys compete in real uh, live game action for the first time this weekend against Southern Wesleyan and Lander? It's, it's been a really productive preseason. I've been, I've been pleased with uh, the way our guys have responded. I think um, – uh, you know, we, we've had a taste of, of, of outside competition with our scrimmages, and those were those were really um, productive. But it, it's time now to start playing, and uh, we're ready to uh, sort of put it out there and see what kind of how much progress we've made uh, from from the start of, of the preseason until now. Last year, you opened up the season with these two same two teams, Southern Wesleyan, coming off of a two and twenty six season. Lander a little bit more productive, twenty two wins last year. Uh, for the Bearcats, what sticks out to you about the two sides? Well, th 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 those were last year, uh, last year's teams. You know, uh, both of these uh, schools have new teams this year, and so we don't we don't read anything into <clears throat> the, uh, the 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 records or or, or uh, who 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 uh, graduated from which teams. We respect everyone's opponent, and we expect the processes we put in place for preparation. And so we, we go into this thing knowing that, that our, our opening tip against uh, Southern Wesleyan will be really challenging. They gave us all we could stand last year, had us beat here basically, and we we uh, <clears throat> we held on and uh, or really clawed our way out of it and, 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 and got the win. And then of course Lander defeated us here last year. So um, you know we we um, are just um, going to enter this thing with a mentality that says we're going to control what we can control and uh, and and sort of learn more about these teams maybe. Uh, throughout the game, because at this point, it's it's really hard to know exactly what they're going to do because it is there's no there's no there's no uh, scout tape out there that we can evaluate. Um, so it's a, it's a little bit of a shot in the dark, but but that's okay. I mean, I think we I think we're prepared to handle uh, any any possibilities at this point. I suppose the flip of that is that there's also no scout tape on Carson Newman. Uh, eight fresh bodies come into the the orange and blue uh, jerseys this season. How do you typify what Carson Newman's going to look like? After seeing uh, the Eagles in all the preseason practices this year, uh, it's, it's going to be. Uh, I think it'll be a little bit different. Um, uh, I, I think that potentially, and, and there's some assumptions I'm making here that we're healthy and that, that we've got access to all the players that we brought in and, and that we're returning. But uh, assuming that we have access, then um, I think that this uh, potentially could be uh, a, very, a very deep team, a very athletic team, a bigger team, maybe across the board. Um, uh, you know, I, I like the fact that it appears that we have the ability to score from from in and out. Last year, we didn't take a lot of threes. Uh, we shot the three, we shot the percentage wise, we shot them well. But we just didn't take a lot. Uh, but I think we could have a, a bit more balance there. And I think defensively, you know, we've uh, I think we've got a chance to, to mix it up a little bit and uh, and be a, a multiple defensive type team right now. Uh, I think it got cooler <laughs> downstairs a little bit. So uh, m mix it up, or you're not just referring to the zone then? No, no. I mean, we, we, the, the zone has been really, really good to us. Um, and we don't really reference it as a zone exactly, but, but <laughs> for, for, for lack of for a better purpose, word. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, it's been something we've, we've – it's been sort of a, an identifying marker for us the last five seasons, and it's been good. Uh, and we still have it very much in, in, in the rotation, so to speak. But we've added a couple of little wrinkles in there just uh, to be a little bit more diverse maybe and to try to really to try to help uh, both our new guys and old guys to be on the same page at the same time it's that 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 that, that the defense we've used the last five years is, is almost like a journey you know and if somebody's 100 miles down the road uh, uh, you're not going to catch them overnight mm -hmm. so to speak so you know we we're, we're thinking that if we can have a couple other uh, options that, that maybe from day one we can be a little bit more uh, a little bit more uh, unified and, 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 and capable as a team uh, than, than, than if we just had the, the zone. What are the big, biggest areas of em, if it, emphasis for correction from last year to this year? Well, you know, I, I thought, um, and, I, and I guess you can always say this, but it, it's just a reality. And I, I know that people think, well, you, you know, you, you know it's, it's, it's an excuse. Well, I, I don't buy that either. I mean, we, we had significant injury last year, mm -hmm. and there's just no getting around that. So um, we would hope that, that, that uh, good fortune uh, would befall us and that we would uh, stay healthy this season. And um, like I said, you put a team together, and, and, and 
you, you, you put it together based on the strengths and weaknesses of the individuals and how they fit in terms of a depth chart. And, uh, you know, we, 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 we go into this thing thinking that if, if all those people are healthy and we're, 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 we've got everybody at, at our beck and call, then I think we could, I think we could be nice. Now, beyond that, um, you know, I think, I think maybe uh, other than the fact that we were beat up, uh, I think that um, our ability to, um, m well, more or less diversify uh, and, and, and have more um, things, especially on the defensive side of the ball that we uh, are capable of doing. And that's, again, I've, I've liked the way we've defended and we've been a top three team in our league every year doing that. And, but I think this could, I think this could uh, make us a little bit, a little bit better. Chuck, pleasure as always. Good luck this weekend against the Warriors and Bearcats. Thanks, Adam. It's Carson Newman Head Men's Basketball Coach Chuck Benson. I'm the voice of the Eagles, Adam Cavalier, and this is CNEagles.com.